WTFNN. Headline News Update. And welcome all to another excellent edition of a market update at 2 p.m. with me, David White, here at TFNN. So what do we have going on right now? Well, we're down, say, what is it, 17? Let's get it right here. Yeah, 17 and a half points on the S&P cash. Uh, Dow's down 37 points. NASDAQ's down 68. And we've had a real bull battle, a uh, bear battle uh, today. Uh, it seems like once we get down somewhere around the uh, 395 on the spies, uh, selling dries up. Above that level, we have massive amounts of short selling. So we'll see. It's a little bit of trench warfare today uh, as we go through it. We're waiting for earnings out after the bell for a handful of stocks. I don't know if they're going to move the market that much. Uh, but we do have a few. Probably the biggest one is Salesforce. And, of course, a um, lot of news about activists getting involved uh, in that. Uh, I have my own opinions on it. But, uh, you know, they bought Slack, and that's become a disaster for them. Um, you know, they've done some other stuff. They certainly have thrown a lot of money at ads trying to keep the uh, stock price up. Uh, but uh, giving away a bunch of board seats, my guess is that the current CEO, the only reason he's been there for so long is he had uh, a couple of friends at CNBC and they always tried to make him look good no matter what was going on, especially over the last couple of years when everybody did extremely well in the cloud services and uh, they didn't do much of anything. I think there is a problem with their business model, but uh, a bigger problem with their CEO and the board seats are probably the first step of getting rid of Benny off. And, you know, when you look at it, uh, it's just hard for me not to think that Kramer giving him a lot of softballs over the last five, six, seven years has been the only reason why he's still. Hang on for a few minutes and we'll be back with the really big show. The reality is that navigating financial markets 